hello and welcome to tutorial for you channel in this video i will show you some method to fix roblox crashing without any error messages randomly after 5 to 20 minutes of gameplay so let's get started the first solution is to visit the roblox server status website its link will be in the description to check if there are any ongoing issue if the server are down you will have to wait until they are fixed However, if that is not the case, follow the step in this video to fix the issue. If you have a problem with some games, try playing a different game to see if the issue continues. Sometimes the problem might be a bug or issue in that specific game. Sometimes problem like this can happen because of the hardware devices connected to your computer, like a steering wheel or other accessories. Remove these devices and restart the game to see if they are causing the issue. Remove any third party software from your PC, whether it's a cheat or a game enhancer. Once removed, relaunch the game to see if this resolved the problem. First, let's open the device manager. In the device manager, locate the display adapter section and expand it. Mine is Intel HD graphics family. Your will be named different. Right click on it and select update drivers. You will have two options. Choose browse your computer for drivers. Then click on let me pick from a list of available driver on my computer. Pick the same driver and click on next. This process will repair your driver and fix any problems. Your screen may go black temporarily but there is no need to worry as it will come back. Once the driver is repaired simply close all the windows. First right click on the game icon and select open file location. Copy the file location, then navigate to the graphics settings, click on browse, paste the location here, select the game and click OK. Now go to the option and set it to high performance. Open your computer desktop, look for the search box in the bottom left corner, click on it and type Roblox. From the search result, find the Roblox player and right click on it, then select open file location. Then right click on the Roblox player icon and choose properties from the menu. In the properties window, click on the compatibility tab at the top. Check this box that says run this program in the compatibility mode and select Windows 7 from the drop down menu. Scroll down to the settings section and check the box that says run this program as an administrator. Click the apply button at the bottom to save the changes. To troubleshoot further, click on Run Compatibility Troubleshooter button. Choose the option that says Try Recommended Settings and then click on Test the Program. Wait for the troubleshooter to reinstall Roblox and optimize the programming setting. Once the process is complete, click OK and then click Next. Select this option that says Yes, save this setting for this program. After a moment, you will see a message confirming that the issue has been fixed. To completely remove Roblox from your computer, search for percentage local app data percentage and delete the Roblox folder inside. Then go to the temp folder and delete as many files as you can. Don't worry, these are the cache files and will be recreated. Empty your recycle bin. Then open task manager, go to the startup tab and then turn off as many program as you can. These programs start up when your computer start, temporarily disable them. After that, shut down and restart your computer again. Finally, try reinstalling Roblox. This will get you a new copy and might fix any problem. Click on the start menu and type lusrmgr.msc. Then click open to proceed. In the local users and group windows, double click on the user folder. Then right click within the folder and choose the new user option. Provide a username and full name for the user account and then type in a password or leave it blank. Uncheck the user must change password option and click create. After creating this account, close the window. Next click on start menu and select your user icon to locate the newly created user account. Click on it and log in with the password you have provided. It will take a few minutes to set up the display. So please wait until it's done. If you ever wanted to delete the account, simply right click on it to delete. You might receive a warning if the user is logged in. Just click yes to confirm the deletion.
If this fixture don't help and you really want to play Roblox, try installing the game on your mobile devices as a temporary solution until the problem on your PC get fixed. First you need to uninstall your previously installation of Roblox. Simple search for control panel, open it. Change the view type to category and click on uninstall a program. From the list of program locate Roblox, right click on it and select uninstall. Next open the Microsoft Store and search for Roblox. Click on get. If you are not already signed in to the Microsoft account, it will prompt you to do so. Once you sign in, Roblox will begin downloading. After the download is completed, click on play. You will then need to sign in with your Roblox account. If you are forgetting your password, you can watch this video tutorial on how to recover it. Its link will be in the description. After signing in, congratulations, you have successfully downloaded Roblox and now you can enjoy playing any games without worrying about any errors. Great, that's all for this video. Let us know in the comment section if you have any question and which method work for you. If this video helped you, please give this video a like and if you want to support this channel, hit that subscribe button. That's it for this video. I will see you in the next video. Until then, take care. Have a nice day.